ndani ya skofu wetu na hata akawapatia na nyinyi mkasaidiana tukafika mahali tumeifikisha bwana asifiwe na tuko tunaanza watu wengine na hii hatua ambayo tunaienda tunahitaji Mungu atupatie elimu nyingine tena ya kutupeleka kule kwingine sema amina Amen. Yesu akamwambia kwamba nenda uuse viti yote yenye uko na baada ya kuziuza zote ukuje upatie masikini Mwenyewe ile ile ndio mabua kali ngoro kwa bela la sana. Na hapo ni kushie ni ndivi yake. Bwana asifiwe. Ukiwa unataka kuvii ngoro. Na hapo na shida. Na shiama la yeye ni kuta. Akwai pata maneno ya ufalme. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Nikodema asakutana na Yesu akamwambia Yesu natamani sana ni uone ufalme nitafanya nini? Yesu akamwambia ndio uone ufalme. Lazima usaliwe mara Akauliza Nikodema, akauliza Yesu kwamba nitaingiaje tena kwa tumbo la na mabaki. Akamwambia bibi akusaliwa mpya ni kwenda katika upati. Utakuwa umesaliwa. Nikodema asakakubali, akaona ufalme. Bwana asifiwe sana. Haleluya. Ambie mwenzako kuna elimu nataka ikuweke kwenye mataka. Jina la Bwana liamtue sana. So tunapokusanyika mbali hapo tunaomba Bwana licha kwamba Mungu ametusaidia tumefika mahali kwenye tumefika na twesi tukajikonga mifua nikombe letu tumwambie Mungu ya kwamba tusaidie Bwana tupatie elimu nyingine ili twende an extra mile. Yes. Jambo linalofuata kanisa ambalo niko nalihubiria leo kuniruhusu ni kuita kanisa. Maana wewe ni kanisa langu sasa hivi. Mimi ndio pastor wako. Ndiye Yesu mwokofu. Amen. Nakwacha baada leo niko na kanisa. Na kanisa lakini kanisa lenyewe lenye nahubiriano watu wananiangalia hivi. Lakini <laughs> naona wengine wanapenda and harvest. Amen. Anasema pale kwamba winter and summer. Praise be to Jesus. Azitawai isha so long as dunia itumu itumupo. Amen. Manye kubeza mshibala mno, ndio kuchenda mno, kukabe vibeza baadala. Kadaba kwa shat. Bwana asifiwe. Na ukisikia kwamba mtu anasema bwera ajele bane, era ajele. Mreba ngo ajele mukunda. Kwa sababu shamba hii shamba iko. Tena na Bwana aliyapitia. Na ukisikia kwamba mtu amevuna kuna nini? Kuna mbegu alifanya nini? Alipanda. Bwana asifiwe. Ukisikia mtu anaenda kupanda ama ameliandaa shamba, iko mbiki kwa mikono yake anaenda kupanda. Nataka niseme Bible says the book of Psalms 126. Amen. Ya kwamba majira ya kupanda ni ya uchungu. Wataenda kupanda kwa uchungu. Lakini watarudi na nini? Na furaha. Sema amen. Tuko vile tulivyo mheshimiwa kwa vile alivyo ni kwa sababu kuna mbegu zilipandwa. Amina. Na hizo mbegu zikatoa matunda ambayo leo tuko mara hapa tunasherekea kwamba mheshimiwa alipita. Tumpe Yesu makofi. Hizo mbegu zikatoka wapi? Bwana Yesu asifiwe sana. Hizo mbegu zikatokana ni kwa sababu ya gharama ambayo wewe na mimi na mheshimiwa Instead of complaining, let us end up in Thanksgiving. Amen. Yes, maneno yanaweza kuwa machache sana. Mtu anaweza kuwa hakuna. Lakini neno shukrani lina maana sana. In the book of Luke 17 11 to 19. Bwana asifiwe sana. Nimeandika ambao mnayajua wengi mmeyasoma. Tena na Bwana niambiwe sana. Kuna wakati ambapo Yesu aliongea habari ya huduma ambayo alikuwa anaifanya akisema kwamba kuna watu kumi walikuja na kawaponya nini? Mkomo. Baada ya kuwaponya mkomo, amen. Mzazi alijaza hata jana hawana. Jana hawana shina. Enechi jili ya kwa Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Kwa hiyo si yeye ana naye ni asifiwe sana. Bwana Yesu asifiwe sana. Maisha ambayo tunaishi. Neno thanksgiving ni la maana sana. Amen. Amen. Shukrani ni kitu ya maana sana. Ambie mwenzako kusema tu asante. Ni ya maana. Amen. Maana inasema kwamba kwa wale kumi tisema tu na hadi mwaka na 20. Lakini mwenye anajua mwana wale 
kukusanyika mahali hapa kusikia neno litoka nalo kwako na hata kukutana kama jamii my father ya wanalorani roho mtakatifu hawa ndio viongozi ambao ilishadai uliwateua ukawapatia nafasi my father chini ya mtumishi wako ambaye ulimteua kuwa mp wa hii maeneo ya lorani na kuinua bwana kwa neema ambayo umemfuatia kwa miaka tano iliyoisha na pia Mungu nataka ni kuinue tena kwa nafasi ambayo umempatia Tunaomba kwa mshatai kama viongozi kama tulio pamoja na yeye. Tunaunganika katika lugha moja. Maana ndani ya umoja, Roho Mtakatifu kuna makubwa huwa unayafanya. Katika jina la Yesu tunaomba kwamba ukazidi kutubariki. Ukazidi kuinua dorambi. Ukazidi kuunganisha viongozi hawa na watumishi wako wote watembee katika lugha moja. Wanene habari ya kuinua dorambi, wana si habari ya kushusha dorambi kupitia kwa damu ya Yesu. Wewe ni Mungu ambaye unapeana hekima. Ulimpa Suleimani hekima. Roho Mtakatifu tunaomba hekima kwa kiongozi ambao umetupatia majira haya. Uende mbele zake. Musa alikuomba kwamba enda mbele zake. Ukaenda mbele zake Roho Mtakatifu ukamsaidia Mungu wetu liye mkuu. Sasa Bwana kamsaidie mtumishi wako. Kasaidie wote wanaofanya kazi chini yake. Ninaomba afya njema juu ya wao wote. Wapatie afya itokanayo kwako. Roho Mtakatifu tukikataa kila visuisi vyote mtakapo tuandama katika jina la Yesu kabla ya kushindwa. Natamuka amani yako ikatuandame kuanzia sasa hivi. Kwa Kristo tumeomba na hata kuamini. Amen. Barikiwa sana. Amen. Ya Mungu mkopi wa. Asante sana, asante sana. Tukae wajulaji, watumishi wa Mungu, Sheikh Sadala mwalimu wetu mkubwa na wazee ambao mko hapa na mama na mama wangu ambao mko hapa wapendwa mrembe 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 huli salamu za ushindi tumekuja hapa na kabla sijazungumza mama wenu wa Tanzania tumefanya naye miaka tano tumekuwa karibu kama familia it's very important that she greets you I give my speech then we begin looking him la wengine kujua ni nini natokea huko. Let us thank the Lord and constituency. Atuneshe wa Mungu. Watenda kazi. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Majina yangu ni Rosie Kamala. Nachukua nafasi hii kushukuru Mwenyezi Mungu kwa ushindi na nawashukuru kwa kazi ambayo mmefanya mmefanya kazi kama timu moja na unajua m, kazi ikiendelea mkiwa timu moja ndio ushindi unafanya nini unapatikana mmekuwa competent sana umekuwa available wakati wa wote ambapo mnahitajika mlikuwa mnapatikana mlikuwa aggressive Yaani ukituma mmoja wenu enda ufanye hiki na hiki hamkuwa na ile wasiwasi eh, mali nimetumwa ni mali pagumu ama ni mali pazito mlikuwa aggressive mnaenda na mnafanya nini mnafaulu tena ndani mwenu mlikuwa na the fear of god 
ambayo iliwawekea na ikawa na heki nyingi ya kutatua mambo ambayo yalikuwa yanatokea mwishowe mlikuwa prayerful hayo maombi ndio yalifungua njia kwa sababu wakati mwesha aliingia kwa ofisi naweza sema grant ya Lorani ilikuwa mahali kama hapa kupitia kwa kazi yenu timu wa imesonga wapi na ni maombi yetu ya kwamba grant itaendelea kusonga wapi sababu ya support yenye yeye mwenyewe amenipa. Kuna support nyingine ambayo Mungu tu ndiye anakupatia. I want to thank God. Eh wale ambao mnaamini hapa, I want you to know na nashukurani kwa Mungu. Hata vile papa amekuwa akihubiri anarudia tu yenye yemezungumza I had I preached in Cornerstone after many months of not being there today. And my message ndio yenye umepeana kila kitu kila kitu kila kitu <laughs> na nikajua kwamba Mungu ameweka kwa wale ambao mnaamini and you are true believers you know every season has a message yeah. every season every season each season is different na lazima ukisikia mtu akisema nimebarikiwa kanisani inamaanisha huyo mtu anatembea in the message of the season so and i think this is the message of the season na definitely god begins to work in somebody's life Eh, kuna mwimba ambao anasema ninaenda viwango vingine hizo viwango hazuwezi patikana mpaka tuwe na mioyo ya shukrani where we thank god for where we are coming from so i'm very grateful ambayo Mungu ametupatia uzima tulikuwa na miaka tano ya ajabu sana na kumbuka tulikuwa katika msimu mmoja naitwa resist ndio natoa baba Raila Molo Dinga kwa airport we almost died walilipua ya gas kwa gari ambayo nilikuwa niko ndani and we were out of breath na marisasi natembea hata honda bombui robert bombui alipigwa marisasi tatu aliishi kwa hospitali muda mrefu sana so watu waliumia tumekuja na covid covid imebeba wa bunge hata mheshimiwa mrunga was very close to me ilimbeba ikaenda na yeye hata mimi kanisukuma so many things hata hapa lorami nimeona mkono wa mungu Mnajua kwamba this Lurambi watu wataki kusema lakini tuseme kweli Lurambi ndio the senior most constituency in Western Kenya. Yeah. Senior most kwa sababu sisi sio tumebeba regional headquarters ya Western Kenya. Mm-hmm. Na hii constituency one year two years wamekukataa. Na wakikukataa uweze tembea, matanga uweze ienda, town uweze pita, wanakukataa. But walinipenda for five years hata nilikuwa na makosa hapa na pale kidogo kidogo lakini Mungu akafunika. Na watu wakanionea huruma na wakanipenda na wakanibeba. Na ile kura ambayo walipiga ilionyesha kwamba walikuwa na upendo wa ajabu. Because we tumekuwa very historical. Kwamba in the entire history mimi ndio mbunge wa kwanza kushinda vitu yote. all the world sita tulichukua kila kituo kila kituo kila kituo na na ninashukuru sana na wale ambao mnatoka Busoso South na Busoso Central na mnatoka kwa jamii hapa Mweche when you go home mbona hapa Mweche bishop anashukuru sana ninaongeza shukrani kidogo juu kwa hiyo nyumba ya Mweche because walikuwa na mtoto wao mwenye uwezo Professor Hainga is not just is not another Nikiru. Mm-hmm. Professor Hainga is a man mm-hmm. of stature, musomi, one who can contribute pakubwa katika nchi ya taifa. Lakini watu wa jamii ya Mwecha wakasema hamana tunamwamini wacha tumpe kura. Mm-hmm. Ukiona vile kura ilikuwa inatembea unapata tuke mlundu mlango moja hamala hapo na 200. Labda professor hapo na 40. Hiyo ilikuwa inaonyesha the Bamwege clan walikuwa na decision and I want to thank the whole clan but also thank your clan na tumefika kiwango ya kufanya kazi na kutumikia watu pia ninataka nishukuru familia kwa sababu 
Mama, we are going to do it. We are going to do it. It's very important to say that. That is why I can't do it when you're even one night. To be honest. Chame, we are going to do it. And the car many nights alone. <laughs> it's very important to say. Kama to na campaign, kama to kona the cow. Yeah, I'm going to nyumba satisa ya usubui peke yake. Na sisi tuko satisa hapa na mkutano kwa hii nyumba tu mekaa ha. Last man is me. Niko na yeye shukrani. Na I am very thankful for my family. Kwa kujitolea. Watoto wangu kuniombea wachungaji wa kanisa letu na pia wachungaji wa wa wa, wa, wa kando na makanisa yetu but also wachungaji wa Kakamega hii mzima the whole of this Kakamega the whole of Lorambi mapastors wa makanisa yote ambao walikuja pamoja na kwa kauli moja they stood in their pulpits and gave the election and said we want the man of God to be our MP. I want to say my to me and wisdom. Oh, and then we will get a now and say my direction. You are what you are. When I do to the end of Raila Odinga, that's a Bible to look up for Katikati, kill a mother of the network. At a lot of when I say my money, I'm here as a bishop. Oh, William Marafzako and Mepata, and I will with a budget. I am the MP. I am the one who is in the parliament. Funny, am I a job seeker? I am not a job seeker. Those who are seeking for jobs and you are willing to do what you want. But me, I am your honourable member of parliament, gazetted, sworn in. That is what I am. You are what you are. In your office, the sungura. While you are going to kifaru, you are going to say nyama. Na mimi na sungura yangu pia kwa tangu nasa nyama yangu. Chita ni mimi. We are here. We have no problem to tafanya kazi. He nyumba ai kuwa nyumba. He nyumba ni maisafisha. But I was not in government. I've worked. We are here. And we do. I'm not in government. I'm going to come back to you. Amen. Amen. There will be no cost for Allah, so we are okay. Now, they will just uh, disappear. They will just 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 disappear. They Asante kwa kutembea na mimi. I may not have been the best. Lakini mwili nifumilia. Tukwa na watu hapa mbao wako kwa mshara. They volunteer. Mwana kamutu kama mea. Mea hako kwa mshara. Yule ka settlement haikuwa ito kea. Lakini alikitolea na gabi yake. Alikuwa na tembea, naenda. Vele, tunaza kumpa sangu mako. I want to thank you so much, you said. You stood with us as an elder, Bukash Saidia Shiyunzu, Bishop Maina, the team Shiyunzu. Shiyunzu was always elusive. But you could have a package, Shiyunzu can give 100%. Kula ya kama la kule Shiyunzu, ilikuwa ni nyingi. So I am very grateful for each one of you. It is not my scheming, it is not my arrangement, but it's by the grace of God and by your collective work that has put me where I am. So the theme of today was just to say Asandeni. Now, as much as we came to a term of service in Misha on the 8th of August, that is when everything Sai sasa kama mmekaa hapa mmekaa tu kama raia marafiki zangu kwa sababu the term of contract ilisha na wale mmekuwa kwa kwa CDF I will work with the manager ambaye tuko naye for now najua hata hii mambo ya manager change huko mbele things change eh, so that tuhakisha ya kwamba 
wale mumefanya hapo pesa ikiingia we find out how to take care of you hivyo hivyo namna hiyo wale ambao wamekuwa parliamentary na wale ambao wamekuwa nje we shall find a way ambayo tutaona kale ka gratitude kanaweza tembea ukiwa na sungura na ndogo mgawane sichukue sungura yote kwa sababu sungura ni ndogo hata wewe peke yako huwezi kipa na kama umejua hii kitu haiwezi shibisha wewe so it's better to split so that at the end of the term kila mtu ajisikie ni mashukuru na niwaambie the term ended na tumekutuka na wenzetu wengi ambao wametusaidia kazi hakuna hata hata William Ruto president wetu hawezi shibisha watu wote hata wao naona wanakimbia mbio mbio na kama dunia imeisha wakienda huko there's nothing because Raisi William Dr. Hakuna na watu wamekufa na yeye. Kuna wale watu walikufa na Dr. William Ruto. Hata wakati mimi nili walk out nikatoka, nikaacha kiongozi wangu. Kuna wale wame stick na yeye paka mwisho. Na mimi paka niwe mungwana. Niwaache wajune mnyama yao. Hapana kuona ni uliacha wenzangu na mimi wa kwanza tena kufika. That's bad manners. <laughs> That's bad manners. Good manners dictate since I didn't finish the trip with them I step back ni wache wao waendeshe wafanye barbecue yao waweke tomato sauce waitane vile walivumiliana hiyo safari that's why nasema ninapoona watu wengine wanakimbia there are opportunities you know president william ruto ni mtu mgarimu na na welcome kila mtu but also if you are an adult wewe umekuwa ukitokana huyu hujakuwa na yeye umekuwa kando lakini vitu vimeiva wewe ndio mate kama fisi wewe ndio wa kwanza kufika hapo that's terrible that's terrible some of these leaders are not leaders they are not even supposed to hold any leadership in our country unakuwa mungwana kama mimi hamala daytime najua kwamba nilikula kona i don't have to be reminded that when i know nilikula kona kona na mkubwa yangu mtabadi ameua kifaru wakati mimi nimekula ko sipaka niangalie kwa friends sipaka <laughs> niangalie kwa friends siwezi kuwa wa kwanza na kisu kwa mkono wacha dakika la afike kwanza wacha kileo afike kwanza wacha goi afike kwanza lakini mimi nikae kwa friends nikichungulia huko but mimi ni wa ilisu ngura yangu mimi nachemsha nikiku nikikula Kenya should have good manners. Na pia what I would also tell my friends ambao wanakimbia wakisumbua rais William Ruto kuenda kumsumbua wanajua wajakuwa na yeye wangemwacha apange kazi yake na wale ambao wamekuwa waaminifu na yeye. He is has a space. When he needs us he let us know. Na ni mzuri kusema hii kwamba hizo mnaona mapicha watu wakikimbia wale wanataka kupiga picha na rais dr Ruto wakimbia usiku wa leo na ke on tuesday let me tell you when dr william samoe ruto is sworn as president hata ukipiga simu inafanya tu 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 haivi sasa kuingia state house utashangaa karen ni karen na state house ni state house these are two different places na sheria yake ni tofau. Eh, hey, so wale mnakimbia you have until tomorrow midnight <laughs> to run. But on Tuesday wakati anaingia kasarani. Hiyo mapicha yenu mtaionea view sasa. We will be meeting what happened. You guys of African Union. Eh, European Union ambassadors they want to meet the president wa unge bilateral talks. They were fun and they don't push with another tour. They were with a tour and they were going in. I'm telling you, we were with Yangu ya Kula Mangu. Eh, we were forget this kwa siasa we were ngangana upate kiti yako. Au ukitumia ODM polo umeingia. Ukitumia gani Murungeti pale umeingia. Ukishaanguka there is no space for failures. Once you follow the you are pungu hiyo. Eh? Unasikia? Eh, hey, so hiyo ni mawapati yako hindi. Wale walikuwa wanashindwa. Bishop atakuwa namna gani? No, those are my friends. But we allow them an opportunity wapange nyumba yao. Na mimi niko hapa nje. 
kama mjumbe wenu ile pesa tunapewa ya serikali CDF tutatumia kumaliza hapa tajenga tumalize miradi we shall keep working working and working working with you and working for you na rais anapokuja kakamega mimi ni mjumbe wa hapa mimi ndio nitakuwa wa kwanza kumwambia your excellence karibu akisema rafiki yangu nataka niingie kona stone ni abudu hapo tunatengeneza hapo anakuja na abudu yes sisi hatuna maneno ingine but mambo ya kuwaya waya na kuchanganya watu wetu hiyo ndio nasema hatutaingia kwa mambo kama hayo amen but yetu ya hapa ni shukurani na mimi kuwatakia kila laheri e, kama mlisema kitu ikakufinya roho yako unisamee kwa moyo wako if i did anything or i didn't live to expectation find it in your heart to forgive me i'm human na i get overwhelmed kutunza watu a quarter of a million is not easy paka ni mahitaji ni mengi hata sasa naona wamefinya mishahara ya wabunge wametoa hii hiyo parliamentary money wamefinya we may not even have enough money to employ people close to the number i had hapo nyuma cdf ndio iko kotini walitoa ile act ya cdf 2013 the court imesema is unconstitutional and the court ambayo imesema ni supreme court the act ya yeye tunatumia sasa ng cdf 2015 is already contested in the high court na unajua the high court might just go to the ruling of the supreme court so kuna mambo mengi ambayo maybe i may not be able to have more employees the way i had number two, ukiangalia eh, cdf nairobi waliniambia ofisi ya center here relinquish because the constituency cannot operate two offices they only operate one one unaweza pata wale employees or employees walikuwa hisiru hakuna ka yeah, there are so many things that are going to change but i don't want you to judge me negatively hiyo mambo iki change sisi tushikane mali tunaweza kusaidia itakusaidia if i can't employ you lakini naweza sukuma yule mtoto wako mahali fulani ni haleluya niweza kulipia wewe fees ni haleluya sababu watu kiongea negative kuniuzu it doesn't hurt because nimezoea kazi yangu tumezoea watu kutuongelea hata kwa mitandao kila mahali sasa sisi ya hiyo hatujalishi but we must be realistic that uh, opportunity does not mean payroll opportunity means there are many things abasi naweza fanya kwa kuni day is thanksgiving second year na upango sio kwa hiyo sio hapo sio umba poko ni sala sio na mko na fraa sio hata ni majanga mshe kidogo kama la pa kama la ria kwa mama fai safi so sisi Eh bisho kuniruhusu niongee kinyobara. Eh mtu kwa kusubira sana. Kuniende imani naiwe. Huyu alala na mate na washukuru sana. Na watu wao na watu wa tingufu. Omuli toto wala amani. Na watu wa amani na mimi mali tunaenda ni kali sana. Atatembea kwa hiyo imani pole pole mpaka tufike na nimepewa fursa hii ni washukuru wote bisho kwa hiyo patrono wetu na sisi wote tukiwa ndani ya hiyo tree Mungu awabariki sana asante asante bwana kwa mipango iliyo mbele yetu utakufaa nikisha na kutunehemesha kwa sababu wewe ni bwana na kwa jina la Yesu aliye bwana mwokozi wetu
Ja.
are born, you put them together to work, strengthen, and commit yourself towards a, a given achievement. And uh, we thank God that uh, for the last five years, you. <laughs> 